Next piece by uh, Carmen Guerrero Natil. Uh, she's a journalist, author, and public servant who was born in Ermita in Old Manila. She also belongs to a family of many writers and artists. As a matter of fact, uh, one of her aunts and cousins actually are wonderful poets that are representative of Philippine poetry in Spanish. Over an incredible span of 60 years between 1946 and 2006, she worked in various capacities in the Evening News, the Philippine Herald, the Manila Chronicle, the Manila Times, Asia Magazine, and Life. She's written 10 books, including A Question of Identity and the Philippines and the Filipinos. As a public servant, Ms. Nakbil was chairperson of the National Historical Commission during the 1960s and of the Manila Historical Commission in the 1990s. In 1983, she was elected to the executive board of the UNESCO in Paris. Uh, the uh, piece today will be read by uh, Oscar Peñaranda, who happens to be also uh, one of our landmark uh, writers in the Bay Area of Philippine American literature. Uh, he's helped found the San Francisco chapter of the Philippine American National Historical Society as its first president. He also happens to be the current president of the FANS uh, East Bay chapter. She, he is also a board of the directors of Philippine American Writers and Artists, as well as uh, in the board of directors of uh, the San Francisco Filipino American Jazz Festival, which will be celebrating its fifth, amazing, in October. He retired from teaching one and a half years ago. I hate you. <laughs> I'm still teaching six more years to go. He retired from teaching one and a half years ago, having taught at San Francisco State University for 12 years in average middle school for 10. Mr. Peñaranda advocates for the teaching and creation of Filipino heritage studies and Filipino language in all his educational efforts. The author has published two separate volumes of poetry and short stories, and his work has appeared in many, many anthologies. Please welcome Oscar Peñaranda.